is our turn off right here, Grandfather Mountain entrance. A nice Camario. It's an RS. I'm gonna stop right here a second. Woo, look at that, guys. That is so awesome, so beautiful. What a great and wonderful view that is. Now look at that 180 right there. Again, what makes it hard is when you're going up, see? Then you gotta turn, still in that upward position. So, take your time. downhill is a little easy. Okay guys, this is a look from top of Grandfather Mountain. And uh, what a beautiful scenic view this is. You can kind of see down. Yeah, it looks like a mile down right there to me. And uh, you look straight down at the base down there. But uh, So pretty, and you got people up here on top, and that's where we'll end up at. Now they do warn you about like where this guy is in the middle in the blue shirt. I don't know if you can see him or not, but uh, about walking on the edge like that because if you fall, you're dead. It's just simple as that. And here's our bridge. See some people walking across it now. And uh, getting us the highest hanging bridge in America uh, at a mile high. Here's my trusty gold wing. This is really a nice building right here. It has an elevator up to the top too, and you got. You got steps over here to your right, and uh, that, they have winds up to 100 miles an hour to 150 miles per hour sometimes when storms come up. I was up here one time on top of the mountain and uh, just crossed over the bridge, and it was, you know, fairly clear. A storm hit within like five minutes. It was torrential rain. Look at these two up here. These two ladies up here. It's really nice. Let's see what we can get into here. Here we are close to the top of Grandfather Mountain, and uh, we're looking at an apex of it here. We see a couple of people on the very top, and zoom in a little bit, and uh, really shows the, the beautiful overlook that's there. Here's a sign that tells you to be careful not to walk on the edge. You could fall and get seriously hurt, and we're walking toward the bridge now. And look at these flat rocks here have been eroded over time. A very beautiful place up here on the top of Grandfather Mountain. This is the mile hanging uh, bridge. Another view here that shows really the, the beauty and how far you can really see out there uh, with uh, the naked eye. And I'll take and put on a pair of my polarized sunglasses over the lens here and try to see, give you a polarized view. Very, very beautiful. Mm 
We're going back across. We just came from these steps. It's unrugged. It's rugged all the way up to the very apex. Apex being beyond them. Let's see. Here we begin to walk across the bridge here. The bridge is very stable. It shakes a little bit, but extremely stable. And uh, you don't really have to worry about falling off or losing your balance. The rails are real good and the perfect bridge. You can see the beauty on each side of the bridge looking over uh, this metal bridge. Has a good drop there. And again, it's not shaky. Some people are afraid to walk across the hanging bridge, but this one is real stable with the cables. Here's the mile high marker on this green step here. And we look down, and really that's not a mile depth there. That's only probably 80 feet or 100 feet drop right there. The mile comes from the, uh, I guess, the sea level. Pretty view. I can't see the screen, but you can see a long way. Right here we see the apex of the mountain top and that's where we want to be the rocks are not too bad as far as walking across they are rough as you can see but here we see a panoramic view of the beauty of grandfather mountain from the top of it see the hanging bridge there it's a little ways away from us now beautiful day today to be at the top of the mountain you can see really well here's a close-up view of uh, the lake here with some of the houses around it just a beautiful place you can only imagine what it would be like to, to live around an area like this in the valley great day today okay from here you see the hanging bridge another view and this is standing at the apex of the top of the mountain itself, the very top. And look at the different colors and how beautiful and the different hues of the Smoky Mountains. And a clear day, which you can see, seems like forever. Just been a great and wonderful day. And the temperature has been really good and the wind's only been about five, eight miles an hour. Nice GTO. This is part of that building. A little walkway to it. Keeps up with the weather and all that stuff too. And it's got a souvenir shop in the bottom. Yeah, this is Grandfather Mountain Nature Museum, which is really an impressive place to visit. And They have like a zoo of animals all the way around, back and through here. Look at those clouds, isn't that pretty? 